Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Rachel, if you are new here. Today's video is so fun. I feel like I used to watch these videos all the time growing up, so I'm excited to be filming one of my own. I have a what's in my bag from this past winter. I can link it below if you guys are interested. I feel like I have definitely perfected what I like to bring in my bag daily. I find that everything that I have with me, I always am looking for, reaching for, and needing. So just gonna go ahead and jump right in. Everything that I talk about will be linked down below. Along with my Instagram, make sure you follow me on Instagram, subscribe to my channel, um, comment down below if you're new here, and I would love to say hello. So I'm just gonna jump right in and thank you guys all so, so much for watching. First thing, this is the bag that I have been using. I absolutely love it. I got it a few months ago and I've been carrying it like crazy all summer. It's just a bum bag. I really like how I can carry it a bunch of ways. My favorite is just throwing it over my shoulder like this. You can obviously do it like this or throw it behind your back to keep it out of your way completely, just hands free. You guys know the drill. I've been carrying this, I love it. I'm gonna link some similar bags as well for you guys if you want to check out some bum bags, but I love, love, love. And there's a lot more room than what you would think, so that's nice. So let's just jump right in. First things first, I have my phone in my bag. Like everyone, I bring my phone with me places because you need a phone. So I have the, there's Winnie. I have the new iPhone. I think it's called the 11 Pro Max. There's so many iPhones these days, I can't even keep up. But uh, I have the bigger version one and I love it. And then I recently just got this case on it from Case Defy. This video is not sponsored by Case Defy. I just genuinely love this case. It looks like my dog and I'm obsessed with coffee. So it's literally the perfect case for me. So love this. I'll link the case below. Also, if you are a dog owner, they also have, I think they have a lab and then like some type of black small dog, maybe a Frenchie bulldog or something on there as well. Um, I got a lot of questions if I made this case, but no, it's already a design on case to which is great. So check it out. Uh, next up, we've got some sunglasses in here. These are from Amazon. I recently got a pack of these, a black and a tortoise color came in a pack. It was like $12, I think, from Amazon. I can link them. They are so cute and on trend, I feel like, for summer. I also love finding affordable sunglasses to throw in my bag because, as you see, they're just laying in here. They don't have a case or anything, so they tend to get scratched up. And if they do get ruined or anything, I'm not going to be upset about it because they were not too expensive so uh next up we've got this perfume which i really really love i recently just got this from sephora because i was looking for something to uh let me like feel freshened up and stuff when i'm running errands all day so i like to just put it on my wrist and my neck uh it's just like a good little pick me up feel good about yourself if you're out all day and about uh this is the Miss Dior Blooming Bouquet. I really, really love this scent. I have a Dior perfume in the full size, but I just recently tried this one and I really, really like it. It's a nice, fresh floral scent. It's like really light, so it's not like too much if you put it on around people and they're like, like freaking out with a cough attack or something. Anyways, moving on. My wallet. I've had this wallet for years. I absolutely love it. Um, it's just the Louis Vuitton coin pouch. I feel like it's always sold out because I feel like everyone has this, but I'll link it for you guys in case you're interested. And then my car keys, I just keep them on here in case I ever just wanna grab this and run out the door. And I don't wanna bring my whole purse. So I also never carry cash. So I just have all my cards. It's a ton of cards in there and I'm not like a big cash person. It also saves a ton of room in your purse not having a big wallet taking up a bunch of space, so I just like this, it's easy. Next up, we've got some chapstick. This is the Sol de Janeiro Brazilian Lip Butter. I use this all the time, you guys. This is like my sixth or seventh one repurchasing. I love it, uh, I love how thick it is. It's just like nice, moisturizing. I feel like I cannot go anywhere without a chapstick, so love. Uh, we've got a scrunchie in here. I feel like sometimes I'm out and about and I don't have a hair tie on my wrist. Like today I have one, but I just keep a backup in case something happens. This is the slip silk hair scrunchie, whatever you want to call it. These are the, it's, it just flew across the room, but they don't crease your hair. They don't pull out your hair. They're very gentle on your hair. So check those out. They come in a pack of three at Sephora. I always get suckered in and I buy them when you, you know, when you're going through Sephora and they have those little like 
travel size minis as you're like waiting in the line those scrunchies are always just sitting there and i always i'm like oh i could always use more you know just throw it in the bag <laughs> A um, little tiny lotion. I got this as a free gift um, from Sephora for my birthday and I had never tried this scent. This is the Sol de Janeiro, same as the lip balm. But this is, I think it's a new scent, but I'm not sure. But I, I think I like it more than the yellow or orangish color scent. So good. This is the Coco Cabana Cream. And I used to never carry lotion with me in my bag because I just thought it would take up too much room but this one is pretty little I especially like carrying it in the summer because sometimes I'll be out wearing like a little tank top or shorts or something and then you find like your skin's dry or something and you need some type of lotion so it just comes in handy a lot I've already used like almost half of it we have a hand sanitizer um, I've always carried hand sanitizer in my bag like tiny little ones from Bath and Body but especially now it's coming in handy uh, this is just a leftover one from Christmas. I've just been going through all my hand sanitizers. <laughs> but this is just a vanilla, toasted vanilla chai. Really like the scent of it. It kind of smells Christmassy, but I mean, it does the job. Also, that's very drying on my hands, so I like to use the lotion because I'm always putting hand sanitizer on these days. So that helps. Uh, next up, we've got AirPods. These go from bag to bag with me. These kind of just like go everywhere with me. Whether it be I'm like using my beach bag that day or in the car like I kind of just bring these everywhere I went through a phase of not really using them and I'm back on a phase of really using them I think it's because I am really into podcasts right now so I've been listening to podcasts when I go through the grocery store when I'm walking on the beach taking Winnie for walks and stuff so I always have these with me they stay charged for forever which is what I really really like about them they're just easy I like how they're cordless you guys know I've had them for forever uh, if you have the AirPods too, comment down below and let me know how you like them. I've thought about getting the new pair, but I'm kind of like, what's the point? Because those are so great. And my sister has the new ones and she says that they sometimes give her a headache because they're very noise canceling. So let me know your thoughts. Another lip balm. This is a, like more of a glossier side. Uh, this is the Kosas. I don't know if that's how you say it, but I recently just got this and I really like it. It's their wet lip oil. I've already put it on like three times. I don't know why I'm still putting it on, but it's in the shade Jellyfish. I really, really like it. It's simple, light, and I like how it's not sticky. That's like the worst thing when your lip gloss is sticky. And then, no, the worst is when your lip gloss is, you just put your lip gloss on in the car and then you put down your windows and you're like going for a ride and then it's like all onto your face. You, know, you guys know what I'm talking about? I hate that and I feel like I always do that. So, um, also now, I haven't been wearing lip gloss a lot because the mask, I always have my mask on, obviously, and it's like sticking to the mask. But I, I often have a mask in my purse as well, but it's in my car. I leave it in my car or my purse so I don't forget it. So that is everything that I carry in my summer bag. I feel like it's the perfect amount, not too much, not too little, and this bag does a great job at fitting it all. Um, most of the time I'll have my vlog camera in the bag as well and it fits everything so that's really nice so comment down below some things that you guys think you must have in your bag and can't live without i would love to hear and add to my little my little summer bag collection comment down below if you guys are new to my channel i love to say hello to new faces and yeah thank you guys all so much for watching i hope you enjoyed today's little sit down video and i will see you guys all in my next one bye guys